80s are unusually rich for interesting vehicles, it was hard for me to make a top 10 list. I know there are a lot of other vehicles that deserve to be here, but this is my personal top 10 list. If you know a car that deserves to be here, type it in the comments and let's hop in into the top 10 most memorable cars of the 80s. Number 10. Audi Quattro In 1980, this car caused a sensation. She was first to use effectively all-wheel drive system in rally sport, which contributed to unbelievable domination in the championship between 1981 and 1985. The 2.1-liter 5-cylinder straight engines are also part of the legendary heritage of Quattro. Number 9. Ferrari 288 GTO This is a race version based on Ferrari 288 GTB, made for participating in Group B. In these days, this car is one of the most sought after Ferraris. The design comes from Leonardo Fioravanti, at that time chief designer of Fininfarina, and the 2.9 liter V8 makes 400 horsepower. Number 8. Lamborghini Jaupa It is not the most popular Lamborghini in the history, but the reason is that it is a very rare. Only 400 units were made. Introduced in 1989, this is the last Lambo with V8 engine until the appearance of Urus. The idea is to be more accessible, weaker and cheaper than Contoch. The design is from Bertone, the 3.5 liter engine makes 259 horsepower. Number 7. Buick GNX the strange abbreviation comes from the Grand National Experimental. This vehicle is developed in a very small series in partnership with McLaren. It is powered with V6 turbo and 280 official horsepower. This car makes one quarter mile for 12.7 seconds, beating both Ferrari F40 and Porsche 930. Acceleration to 96 km per hour is for 4.6 seconds, again faster than the Ferrari and the Porsche. Number 6. Ford RS200 One more heritage from the rules from Group B, which were forcing manufacturers to sell at least 2,500 units to normal clients to be able to race. The result is street legal rally vehicle with 250 horsepower from the 1.8 turbo Cosworth engine instead of 350 horsepower or 450 horsepower for the racing versions. Number 5. Toyota Supra MK3 the fans of this car so loved by the tuners around the world usually overwhelmed for the MK4. But don't underestimate the older generations. The third generation is with characteristic design for the 80s and can be found with 2 liter, 2.5 liter and 3 liter engine and all kinds of power between 160 and 235 horsepower. Number 4. Ferrari F40 the sign model and the flagship of Ferrari from 90s. Here the Italians abandoned the 12 cylinder and bet on V8 with twin turbo and 478 horsepower. This was the last model approved by Enzo Ferrari personally during his lifetime and it was worth startling for the 80 $400,000. In 1919 Nigel Manso sold his for 1.4 millions. Number 3 BMW M3 at 30 not a few enthusiasts will tell you that the first M3 series from the E30 generation is the greatest car in the history for driving. The nimble 4 cylinder engine makes 200 horsepower for the markets that didn't require catalyst and 195 for those who did. The weight is barely 1165 kilograms and because of the a lot exterior improvements the coefficient of the air resistance dropped to 0.33 instead of 0.38 for the standard 3 series. Number 2. Porsche 959 When it came on the market this was the fastest car in the world making 339 km per hour in the S version and also the most advanced in the technology with system to trace the pressure in the tires, innovative 4 wheel drive and Kevlar case. Boris Becker bought one of the first units. Number 1. Nissan Skyline GTR R32 With really inventive system for 4-wheel drive and tough straight 6 with turbo, 
This car is a legend for the fans of Japanese cars. Introduced in 1989, the R32 generation was created to dominate in the Group A championship and that's why it has impressive for the 80s 370 horsepower. Nissan created almost 44,000 road legal units which makes it one of the most accessible sports car with this kind of abilities. 